developers will unveil their plans for the shops of Grand Avenue next week. Our Corrine Zell joins us live downtown. She has a sneak peek of what we can all expect. Corrine. Carol, new owners took over here in December. They've been talking with people who live in the area and also looking at what other cities are doing to help come up with their own design. It's been a long time since the shops at Grand Avenue were this packed. Today, it looks more like this. They need a lot more down here to get people to come down here more. That's the plan. What we want to do is transform it from what's historically been an inward facing urban shopping mall and and make it more of a mixed use property. Ownership has changed hands many times over the years. Developers claim it will be different this time around. It's not gonna be your traditional shopping mall anymore. It's gonna be, uh, it's always gonna have a retail component, but there are other pieces that have to, that we think have to be put in place, uh, you know, for this to be a vibrant property. Ideas include new dining options, national and local retailers, office and school space, and a grocery store. Changes will start with the third street entrance. And so that invites people in and draws them into the property as, as opposed to we feel currently it, it, it almost serves as more of a barrier. If the plan comes to fruition, nearby residents say they'll be there. Uh, I like the proximity. I do live right down the street. Developers believe the timing is right. The Grand Avenue is in the middle of West Town, which is currently undergoing uh, a real renaissance. Owners will unveil their plan Monday. They don't have committed tenants at this point, but they do have an idea who they're hoping to attract. Live downtown, Corrine Zell, today's TMJ4. Corrine, thank you very much. Now